Dooley County has produced some big names the past few seasons, like Montrevious Adams, now a rising senior at Auburn, and Antonius Clayton, an incoming freshman at Florida. Since Jimmy Hughes got there in 2010, the Bobcats have not had a losing season. He joins our Bill Shanks now to discuss the upcoming season. Here they are in the coach's corner. Jimmy Hughes here, the head coach at Dooley County, now in his seventh season. Boy, you guys have had a lot of success. I mean, it was a tough loss last year to Clinch County in the in the playoffs down there in Homerville, which is never an easy place to play. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, overall, you've got to feel good about how your program's and what it's become really in the six years, are yeah, you? I, I am, Bill. We, um, you know, when I came here six years ago, we just finished our sixth season. Uh, that was really the plan was not to have a team, but to build a program. Right. And, um, you know, we, we, we've, we're slowly but surely getting there. We've, we, we've had some success and we've had a lot of good players. And, uh, you know, our coaches do a great job of coaching them. So uh, that, that really was the goal, and it still is. We want to we wanna be uh, uh, on an even keel most of the time. We don't want to be down and then yeah. way back up. And that's so. hard to do, right, especially it for is. a small school to have that consistent mm -hmm. success because it's almost expected that at some point you're going to take a dip. But for you, mm -hmm. even in six years, to not have that, that's pretty good. Yeah, we had one less than seven games uh, in the six years. And uh, uh, we've been blessed with good players and good administration. So mm -hmm. we've got a good community that supports our kids. Let's talk about your defense for this year. You've got uh, seven back on defense, which is good. But up front, you got to replace some guys, right? Yeah, i got to replace some real good players. Uh, we lost some good players, of course, to uh, Antonius. Clayton, he signed. He's down in Gainesville at the University of Florida. Mm -hmm. uh, we had two other defensive linemen that signed as well, junior colleges. So, um, you know, we, we that's that's a big hole for us. But really, other than that, well, we got some real good players coming back on that side. That's good, no doubt about that. Well, offense is uh, another story. Uh, some good skill players coming back for Dooley County this year. We'll talk with Coach Hughes about that in our next report. Part two of that conversation airs tonight at 11. That